What's going on, Turner Fishing family? Welcome back to the channel. Good morning. So we spent a lot of time near the near the dam, you know, mid lake the past, I don't know, three months. And we've caught a lot of fish, don't get me wrong. You know, we ain't really caught no big bigs yet. So today's plan, the water's dingy. I don't know if y'all can see it. Dingy, muddy, stained, whatever you want to call it. But what this stained water does is those big crappy are a lot easier to get because you can get close to them. We're starting to pre-spawn, you know. I'm gonna be honest, I'm making this intro after I pass this bridge and we just caught three freaking giants off of it. So I hope y'all enjoy today's video. You know, I'm trying to get 20 over 12. Let's get out there. You know, I want to thank the sponsor of today's video, Waterlands Fishing. You know, Bluebird Sky Day, you know, you, you're trying to use your live scope, whatever, and you've got a glare on your screen. These sunglasses block all the sunlight coming out the side so you don't get that, that glare. So you're able to scope a lot better. You're able to fish a lot better. And hey, they make me look pretty good, don't they? <laughs> but right now I'm about to run uh, down the river a little bit. What y'all see that after y'all see the, the fish we just caught off the bridge. Well, they weren't on the bridge. They were just out there in the middle. But we're going to run a little bit down, down the river. We're going to fish this muddy water and catch us some toads, guys. So y'all hit the thumbs up button for me. Subscribe if you ain't. Let's go catch some crappy. That's the rig. We got a snipe beaver split shot. 13 foot ACC. Six pound vicious line. Let's go find us another chicken. Giant crappy dude. Freaking toad. <laughs> Freaking toad, man. Welcome to pre spawn, guys. <laughs> right there in the roof of the mouth. Oh, man. That's probably pound 80. Give or take 13, 14 inch fish. First one of the day, though. Freaking fatty. Oh, that's a taco right there. <laughs> so what i'm doing i mean i'm literally i have my trolling motor on one and i'm scanning around i mean yeah i'm under a bridge but honestly they're not related to these this bridge pylons at all i'm really just working the channel right now so i'm, I'm going very very slow picking my targets and taking my time with it so first big fish of the day though now see the thing about crappy is they're gonna sit a lot more still than other fish like if you're fishing a fish and he's moving all the time it's probably like a bass or something crappy i mean they move but it's not a lot like this fish i'm able to just sit on top i should be able to catch this one The wind's blowing me just a hair. But I'm near him enough to get in the bite. Let's see. Too far to the left. I need to go. I mean, I'm too far to the right. I need to go to the left. here yep. let's drop it down too far to the right again should be perfect right there let's put it right above him so we can get him to bite He ain't even seen it yet. Back to 
boat up just a hair. So I float over top of him. Come on, buddy. I know you see that jig. There he is. Got him. Another freaking toad. Yes, sir. Man, I love pre spawn. Come here, buddy. Another freaking monster. <laughs> you just got to take your time with them. I mean, we're in this stained water. They're not going to move that much. And just... It's a freaking, look at that stomach, man. Oh my God. But it took me, I don't know if I edited through the actual fish catch, but probably a good minute sitting on top of that fish before you even seen the jig. So you just gotta take your time with them. Now orange and chartreuse is really good for the stained water, especially this new orange that I've been making. Y'all see how bright that is? It's a lot brighter than the other one that I was making. So it's doing really good. Let's see if we can find another toad out here. He sees it. There he is. <laughs> Get in here, boy. Another <laughs> just freaking nice one, guys. Uh, that's a 12 inch right there, smallest one of the day. Uh, yes, these fish are so white. Three giants, one jig. <laughs> I'll stop on this point right here. It's a real, you know, kind of round, roundish point. It's got a big flat on it. I'm not going to fish it long, but I want to see if. You know, as fat as those three fish were, was there any that is starting to kind of move up? We just had a full moon, so I just want to check this flat before I head on down. You already got so much debris in the water that you got to dodge, so it's not like we're pressed for time or anything. It's going to take us a while to get there anyway. I mean, it's still early. It's like 9 o'clock. I didn't get out here till 8. We've already got three giants, so... But yeah, it's like a big, like 12 to 15 foot, you know, a couple stumps and st stuff out here. So we're, I'm going to scan around here, see what's happening. Sometimes it's hard to beat old little minnow. Nice one. <laughs> Come here, buddy. Quit. Quit, man. Quit. Help him now. Oh, my God. Oh, another fat chunky. <laughs> 11, 12 inch. <laughs> Jeez, man. Midday update. I think we got about 10. The smallest one is about 11 inches, give or take. So, doing pretty good. But what I seem to figure out, there, you know, I put out a video the other day, you need to look shallower. And the biggest ones I've caught have honestly, you know, been 11, 15 foot. But there are a lot more consistent ones that want to eat in the deeper water. To the first bridge that we were at because we, we had a little bit better quality there there wasn't a lot there but when 
when you dropped on the fish they wanted to eat so we're gonna go try it out it's about noon right now we've been out here since about eight o'clock so got a lot of daylight you can definitely see the dang mud now <laughs> i mean it ain't milk but pretty rough and i believe up here you know a little bit more towards the main leg is a little bit clearer so you ain't got to stick it right in their face so dang much but we're gonna put it together hopefully get a couple more giants had to pull out the old a little reel on him. <laughs> that joker smirked it. Dang wind. Another freaking nice one. <laughs> <laughs> a big butt in here. I have broken off on more fish today than I can count. Like nothing against vicious line, but I believe my lines done got kind of rotten. Another nice one. Oh, he got me, you sucker. <laughs> pretty fish, pretty fish. So I'm out of big split shots. So what I've done, I made some, I think there's a one eighth head. I've got one of them. <laughs> I made a long time ago, painted it green and I got a little split shot, but I'm out of big sinkers and I don't have any barber stops for my half ounce ones. And I put two jig heads on, but it still wasn't fast enough to get down there to them without them. I mean, these fish move. I mean, they ain't sitting still for the most part. And I hung a couple on the throw into them, but I'm more aggravating than it's worth. Got some over here eating shad. They might bite pretty good. I don't know. Joker smoked it. <laughs> that was a freaking nice one. Oh, I'm loving it, guys. Loving it. That orange and green. Bite my jig. Do, do, do. You're not even that big. Don't even know why I'm fishing for you. Because I am too far to the left. Oh, there you go. I got you now. Thank you a lot bigger than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, I had him in a bottom lip too. <laughs> Another nice 12 incher, man. I tell you, when I start catching eight, not eight to 10 inches again, they gonna feel so tiny. I love the free spawn, man. This is the best time of year to fish. Like, that is just, it's just so much fun. These fish are just chomping. If I can get that joker to bite, it'd be nice. As big as he is, he got to be hungry. Uh oh, uh oh. God, I'm not Get in here. <laughs> I 
Yeah, he angry. That's an angry fish. <laughs> Freaking toad, man. That's why you run an ACC right there. It don't matter. You boat flip every time. That dope smoked it too. Dang, he swerved me. Straight swerved me. Oh well. Catch your little buddy down, you know. Maybe he wants to be my taco fish. Do you want to make a taco? He wanted to be my taco fish. <laughs> oh, look at that. That gone hunchback right there. Look at that dang crap. <laughs> he ain't got no belly all back. Shit. One more to go. Oh. Out two pounder. You a, you a turner? Yeah, what's up? <laughs> Alright, that's all out of the gear. I've seen you on YouTube before, right? Yep, yep. I got 19. That, that one right there, probably two and a half, three pounds. I just missed. <laughs> you, man. Yeah, man. Appreciate you watching. get this fish to bite again this is a huge fish and the leaf on my day man if i get this fish to bite again i'm gonna be so freaking happy I just don't think it's possible he's going to bite again. You never know, though. It's a giant. I'll tell you all that now. I got this freaking giant. I'm trying to get lined up on him. I'm on him. I don't think this is the same fish as before. He's a good fish. Still try to get him. It might be two fish. I don't know, but I got him. Oh yeah. That's the stud right there. Oh, that's two pounder. <laughs> get in here. God. He bit again. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> Freaking choke that snipe beaver. Oh, that is a freaking stud. That was at least pound 80, maybe two pounds. Biggest of the day. Oh my God. Unreal, dude. Now for everybody watching the video, like 
I'm not fishing the bridge. Just because I'm under the bridge, they're just in this channel. 